it's interesting because what Isabel said, I'm, I'm kind of finding something like that happening too, though very gradually um, in the sense that a lot of things that uh, liberties that were various, that were kind of extraneous, not really sinful necessarily, but just pastimes that were not really necessary or wastes of time. You know what I'm trying to say? That I allowed myself don't seem to be very interesting anymore. And I find myself very much more interesting in developing my spiritual life. Um, and along with that also, there's been an increase <laughs> almost a dangerous increase in creative ideas you know <laughs> as, you, as, as you know i'm writing a book uh i'm writing the fifth draft of my of my play which is not much it's basically a, a touch-up uh but between writing the book and then we've also decided this is the most difficult and challenging thing the people who have been dedicated to the production of my musical have now decided to do an interactive production of the musical where we're, we have these things where all the musicians, there can be six of them and two of them can be the same person at two different times and they somehow all come out singing the same song. And we haven't gotten to the first song yet, but this fellow who's the engineer, he actually works, Tim, at the uh, Moscow Music Academy, Adrian Crookston, volunteered his services after I saw uh, one of those six frame things where there were two Adrian Crookstons and two of his drummer and, and they were all singing at the same time. And I said, well, this is what we got to do. And so I just sent some of the first music for the first song to the players this afternoon. It's very exciting. However, the uh, overload of like this in, influx of new creative ideas is a, it's a time thief in a way I'm sp spending more time. And um, then of course I had to add to it today's offer which I think will actually help balance things and maybe help me, you know, in other ways as well as help other people of that. I'm offering up to five students tutoring music theory and composition or creative writing of fiction, whoever wants to, to do it. And I got my first student today. So there's sort of like almost an imbalanced overload in these areas that I love that I'm hoping to temper with a greater spiritual practice. And also I'm just shedding all these things that were kind of unnecessary. And that's, sort of what's happening now.